The content on this channel has been created for adults. If you're not at least 13 years of age or older, then please do not watch this content. Sorry, dude. Come back when you're 13. What's up? Welcome back to Off Tap Life. I am Faith Chase, aka Crossfix, aka Chosen Effect, back on the deck, getting ready to wreck the set. And don't you forget, always a pleasure to be kicking it down a notch with all of you beautiful souls. Now, we're getting close, guys. We're getting close. Getting close. The milestones just keep on happening. We keep on gaining traction every day. The family is growing at a phenomenal rate. It's super awesome to see. Lots and lots and lots of beautiful, beautiful people joining our family. And guess what? You too have the opportunity to join the greatest family that's ever existed. Ever on the tube. That's right, that's family. All you have to do to join is click the red box that says subscribe, that's all you gotta do. And then next thing you know, you're part of the family. Yes, oh yes, it's true. Oh yes, it's true. And on this channel, in case you were wondering, in case you didn't get the memo, in case you don't know, in case no one told you, because you're just here for the first time and you haven't had the opportunity to be edumocated. This is the spot you come when you are someone who loves love, who loves life, who loves to live it to the fullest, who loves to keep it off tap, who loves to be part of a community that is freaking full of open arms and tons of virtual hugs and amazing heart parades. That's what's happening here. We're about the love on this channel. So if you're about love, this is a channel you want to be on. And if you ain't about love, well, you know, apparently there's over a million YouTube channels to choose from. So maybe one of them will be about hate or whatever you're bringing to the party and you can go hang out with them. I don't know. I don't care because we don't care what they're doing over there. The Jims, the Joneses. We don't care about freaking Mary Jane down the street. We don't care about freaking Gilligan on his island. We don't care about freaking the Brady Bunch freaking living over there. We don't care about freaking those people that live over on that street, you know, the 70s show, wherever they live. I don't know where they live. We don't care. We don't care. We, we don't. We don't care. We don't care. Even if you're freaking, freaking, Beyonce, sorry Beyonce, but we don't, we don't care. We're here. We don't care what you're doing on your street. We don't care if you waiting for someone to put a ring on it. We don't care if you got a halo. I mean, it's cool having a halo. I mean, I gotta admit that is pretty freaking awesome. I mean, I wish I had a halo. Okay, maybe slightly care about that one because that's cool having a halo. But anyways, we, we, in other words, don't care what other people are doing. We're just doing our thing here, man. We're just keeping it 100 here. We're keeping it freaking just just for reals. You know what I'm saying? We're keeping it a buck. We're keeping it freaking just 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 on the realness right here. That's all we do. We're keeping it off tap. And if that sounds like you, then you need to join us because we'd love to have you. Join us, join us, join us, join us. Click subscribe, eh, hey, click subscribe, eh, hey, click subscribe, eh. Hey. Oh, guys, I forgot to tell you this. This is trippy. I had a dream last night. Dude, seriously. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I forgot to tell you guys this. Oh, should I wait and make a vlog about this? Dude, I've got to make a video about this. Yeah, no, I can't tell you now. I can't. I can't tell you now. Oh, but I want to. 
Okay, this is what I'm going to do. Wait, did I even say what the name of this song is going to be yet? I didn't, did I? I don't think I did. If I did, alright, cancel it. I'm going to tell this story now. And we'll do what I was going to do after we do that. We're gonna, I'm going to tell this story. Dude, I had this dream. Story time. Whatever. I had this dream. Man, so this was crazy. And I mean, it was bound to happen sooner or later. Freddy was in my dream. Yo, Freddy was in my dream. It was a crazy dream. Dude, in this dream, I freaking was doing the, um, <laughs> like I was performing live somewhere, right? And I was decided it would be a good idea for me to do like Freddy does when he goes, hey -o, hey -o. <laughs> You know how he plays with the crowd and does his, his whole call response thing? He's like, hey -o. And and I, I was doing it, right? I was trying to do it in the show. <laughs> and then Freddie came and Freddie Freddie went, You're doing it wrong. <laughs> and then Freddie started doing it right. So Freddie suddenly didn't go, Hey, hey, he's like, That's how you do it. And so I was like, Oh, wow. And I was in awe. I was like, Man. That's why you're the greatest. I was like, I was doing it wrong, man. He's like, you're doing it wrong. It was just like that. He was just like, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. That was such a cool thing, man. And, and then I, you know, started doing it right. You know, and it was great, you know. It, it was great, man. You know, we had a moment. You know, he showed me how to do it right, you know, and then we started doing it together. You know, I was like, Dale, and then we take turns, tag team. Your turn, your turn. It was fun. It felt like it was going to be a longer story. <laughs> okay, yeah, that was, that was really not, not as long as I thought it was going to be. I mean, it felt like there was more to it in the dream. The dream felt longer, like, okay, it was a... It was a whole concert, all right? Like, give me some slack here. It was, it was a concert. It was a, you know, so. But I just thought that was interesting, like, because, um, you know, like, what's, what's the odds of him coming and visiting me? Uh, and, you know, the crazy thing, though, like, let me tell you something. Now, I've had Michael Jackson come to me in a dream before in the past. I think I've done a video on this, and that was a more, I think I shared the story. A lot of people who know me know the story. I've shared this story with a lot of people. Michael said, you know, keep, thank you for keeping my dream alive and all this kind of stuff. It was back when the time when I was actually, you know, doing a couple of his songs in my set um, regularly when I'd gone perform. And um, a lot of people used to say, oh, you sound like Michael when you sing and all this stuff. And someone told me that Michael was my guide and all this kind of stuff. And like, there's a whole story around it. And I've met Michael and like, there's a whole thing. You can probably look back at some of my old videos, either on this channel or my Faith Chase channel. I vlogged about it and stuff. But, but anyways, for Freddie to come, I thought that was really interesting. For Freddie to, I, I wouldn't have thought I would have Freddie in my dream. You know what I mean? Like, and... And I started thinking about it, but why wouldn't he come and visit me, maybe? Because, I mean, I do a lot of his music. Every, you guys think about it. I, I react to a lot of his music. You know, I do a lot of their music. And and I love their music. I, I love them. I, I, I love Freddie. I love, you know, and I think that maybe there was a kind of, you know, like... I'm just gonna go down and visit freaking Faith real quick and just have some fun with Faith, kind of thing. You know what I mean? Just, it was crazy. But I just thought that was cool and I just thought about it when the thing because I I like that when he does that call and come, you know, you know, freaking thing, you know, with the crowd, call and response, you know. And I think that's just really cool, man. Like, I just, I love that interaction. And that's, I think that's why, like, to this day, so many people love them is because they touched people in a way that I don't think many do, you know? Like, everyone has their favorite artists and things like that, but certain artists go above and beyond for their fans to really 
to really make you feel that you really do belong and that you really do matter so much you know what i mean like i think queen that interaction that playfulness that fun thing that they would do nothing nothing matches that i think it's really special so oh, anyways that was my little story time uh, it was pretty cool to me i think it's a pretty cool story i mean it i thought it was longer in my head but in reality but you know sleep time in real life time is different everything seems longer or shorter it's weird it's crazy you can have a dream and it feels like it's been going on for a long time and you wake up and it's like what it's only been five minutes since i've been asleep that kind of thing you know what i mean and then it can be flip side like you feel like you weren't asleep that long and then suddenly you realize you slept for freaking hours that's crazy this whole sleep thing man that's a topic for another day because man seriously sleep and dreams and you know what really happens when you're dreaming what really happens when you're sleeping with your soul you know does it leave your body like there's so many things out there a lot of people have different thoughts on this topic and you know also you know what dreams mean and all that kind of stuff there's so many different thought processes on all that kind of stuff but but you know, that was really cool, man. I, I wanted to share that with you guys and I just did. So thank you for watching and I will catch you on the next one. You already know to live each moment to the fullest and keep it off.